today we're going to be looking at our next type of transformations. We're going to be looking at reflections on the coordinate plane. A reminder, a transformation is an operation or a moving of a figure into a new figure called the image. And with a reflection, the FL and reflection, think of flipping the object or a mirror image. Example one, we're going to reflect an object over the x-axis. So what I want you to think, I want you to think of having your object drawn and tied to your x-axis and spinning it around as though it was attached to a straw or a pencil. Let's look at our coordinates. The first ordered pair is A, 3, 4. So I'm going to go over 3, up 4. Point B is negative 2, 4. And point C is 1, negative 2. To reflect an object over the x-axis, you're going to first graph all each graph each ordered pair. Then you're going to find how far each ordered pair is from the axis of reflection. The new point is going to go on the opposite side across the axis listed. So let's connect these ordered pairs first. Again, we're reflecting around our x-axis. So let's look at how far each point is away from the x-axis. So point A is 1, 2, 3, 4 away from the x-axis on top, so it's going to move 1, 2, 3, 4 points away from the x-axis on the bottom. I'm going to use my prime notation because this is the new and improved A or A prime. Same thing with B. We're 1, 2, 3, 4 away on top, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4 away on bottom. The new and improved B is B prime. Point C is 1, 2 away below the x-axis, so it's going to go 1, 2 above the x-axis and become C prime. Connecting these points together, I have the exact same triangle. It's simply been flipped over. And we'll pretend my lines are a little bit straighter. For a reflection across the y-axis, it's going to be very similar. You're going to find out how far each point is away from the y-axis this time and put the new point on the opposite side. Try this one on your own. Graph your three, I'm sorry, graph your four ordered pairs. Reflect over the y-axis. Pause your video at this time. Your image should look something like this. On the right we have the quadrilateral ABCD. Once it's reflected, it looks like A prime, B prime, C prime, D prime on the left. Again, you have to count how far away each ordered pair is from your X axis. I'm sorry, from your Y axis and put it on the other side. If you got this correct, give yourself a puppy dog next to your picture. If you did not, go back and watch the previous example on ref You have two homework problems tonight. 
Number one, draw a capital letter W on a coordinate plane and reflect that letter over the x-axis. For problem two, draw a capital letter Z and reflect it over the y-axis. It doesn't have to be a really complex coordinate plane, but I do need to see how it reflects. So show me how you counted to get your letter from one side of your axis to the other. See you tomorrow.